Gardens this morning. The boss of an NHS... Fretful nights pass. More fevered days ahead. The Mayor of London, Sadiq Khan, has said he believes people should wear face masks whenever... Yet, far from the capital, in country villages, there is a new calm. Tisbury's butcher, Lee Downer, is putting on extra deliveries. How is it going over the last few weeks with coronavirus around? Um, extremely busy. Um, every, every shopping local. Fishmonger Ashley Major benefiting despite supply issues because villagers want to stay away from big towns. We've got more people staying in the village. People aren't going into Salisbury or Shaftesbury to do a weekly shop. They're shopping local, which is nice. An old resilience is re-emerging, and not just to the country's fickle weather. The community here is fantastic, and that's made all the difference. So uh, we've got lots of local uh, farm shops and small businesses uh, who have been really good at getting sort of small-scale supplies. Tisbury Parish, population 2,400, has a history of getting through tough times. Survived five years of the 14th century Black Death pandemic and is adapting to today's. We've been doing our services over Zoom, uh, which has been very excited. Something else making the difference here too. Distance from the hot zone, London. I think we're probably quite lucky because we're living in the countryside where you, you don't feel you're quite so close to people. Psychological, not just social distancing, the new village normal. I don't look at the news continuously because I think you can fill your head with a lot of uh, negative stuff. I stop by newspapers because it's, um, it's, it's uh, gets a bit depressing otherwise. And this is BBC Radio 4. It's half past four, so it's time for PM with Evan Davis. Hello there. Heading to the fourth weekend of lockdown. Come At the nearby hospital, where the few courageously help the many, infrequent ambulances come and go in calm, inducing silence. Cases of COVID-19 in this southwest corner of the country, so far at least the lowest in the nation. And it's exactly five o'clock right now. Any moment we'll head over to Downing Street for the official daily COVID-19 briefing. Yet, and it's even here, no man an island, no home a castle against the virus's greedy onslaught. 18,978 people are currently in hospital with coronavirus in the UK. And sadly, of those hospitalised with the virus, 14,576 have now died. That is in pretty, well-heeled Tefond Avias, population around 260, five homes have self-isolated so far, the village rallying to keep that number down. The now COVID-19 closed hotel, shopping for the village, saving residents exposure to the virus. Our demographic is quite old, you know, they're all staying in. They don't want to go out, they don't want to have to drive to the nearest village, which is, you know, at least five miles away. So we, we came up with a plan just to do this from here. Rural England has risen. Another three weeks of this? Is that a problem? I used to be in submarines, so nine months, uh, three months at sea, 90 days underwater with 70 people uh, is normal. So sets another day. The only certainty, dawn will follow. And eventually, lockdown, fear and virus will be purged. Nick Robertson, CNN, Stonehenge, England.